how to present the transformer neutral grounding system whether it is solidly grounded or uh, resistance grounded or reactance grounded how to do that and how to assign the ngr values for this transformer so in this video i will cover that part before that let's understand why it is required to restrict to restrict the fault single line to ground fault at different voltage levels sometimes we are using the ngr neutral grounding register transformer neutral grounding register to calculate the lg fault that means single line to ground fault we need that particular information that should be shown here so for that you need to go to the transformer editor go to this grounding tab and here is the symbols check this box grounding element suppose this is delta star transformer you can toggle between delta and star this is delta and this is star so primary connection is delta and secondary is star if you have star delta then star and secondary is delta just toggle between this so i want to assign delta star transformer and what is the okay before that the angle vector group dyn1 dyn1 vector group you can change this vector group by changing the angle here from the drop down list if you change it suppose minus 30 the vector group will change to dyn11 so here is the angle and with the help of this angle you can change the transformer vector group that's fine now coming to this transformer secondary grounding whether it is solidly grounded or registered resistance grounded reactant transformer or open so you need to specify from here so this transformer is mb transformer 16 mb transformer suppose this is resistance grounded so select the register and it will ask for the parameter current what ampere you want to restrict to suppose i want to restrict to 400 amps or let's say 300 amp in case of ground fault i need to restrict the ground fault single line to ground fault to 300 amps and it will calculate the ngr values here 66.39 ohm this is the value of ngr neutral grounding register this ohm and this is the current it will restrict i have checked this box for the symbols so now it will show the transformer symbol here yes it's created so this is delta for for better presentation primary side delta and and this secondary side is star and this is the ngr this is ngr okay so like this you can you can model all the transformer neutral transformer connection like this yes this is similarly for this transformer go to the grounding okay check this box delta star but i have to select 11 that means minus 30 
DIN 11 here it is not solidly grounded resistance grounded it will restrict so 300 amps the ohms will be calculated ok so you can see this is our delta star transformer So in this way you can model this.